Good morning you guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how I actually um, use and incorporate a jade roller into my facial and skincare routine. So let's get into it. I think in my previous video, you guys saw me um, unpacking and sort of unboxing um, a couple of things that I actually bought uh, for myself. And a jade roller was actually one of those items. And this is it. So some of you may be asking yourself, what is a jade roller? A jade roller is basically um, a facial massage tool that is made out of jade stone um, that is actually used to um, massage into your skin to actually promote like blood, blood flow circulation around your skin, helps with a tightness um, of your skin. It can help reduce puffiness around the eyes and just a feel good um, tool. So Jade is believed um, to actually have properties that will um, stimulate your skin and promote your skin to actually um, be tight, um, the blood to circulate a lot more. So if you're somebody who actually believes a lot in like Chinese medicine and crystals and things like that you should check out um jade uh, stone but otherwise um i actually uh, was interested in actually getting myself one um to actually give myself or oh, my face um, a massage because from time to time you feel like your skin is going through the most and myself i'm currently recovering you know from like your sunburn and all of those things so i thought it would be a great time to actually introduce this jade roller into my skincare routine so let me show you how it's used to start it off, um, normally um, I would apply um, this aloe vera jelly um, on my skin just to start things off and massage with um, the rough side of um, the jade um, roller to actually give my skin a nice um, gentle and more like a deep tissue kind of a massage. You can apply um, any um, mm, facial serum that you um, normally use. I just use uh, this aloe vera jelly because I'm so in love and so obsessed with aloe vera these these days. It's been doing a lot for me, really, in helping my skin, um, you know, to deal with a lot of, you know, like um, outbreaks, a lot of spots on my face. And I've been feeling like my skin is a lot um, tighter after I've st I started using um, aloe vera jelly. So I'm just applying a generous amount so that my skin doesn't run dry during um, my massage. And for whatever I do on my face, I like to just bring it down to my neck so that my neck also benefits from everything that I'm doing on my face. So as you saw that my jade roller has two sides, there's one side which has like your ridges, your rough ridges. Uh, I trust it's showing over there. And then you have this side which actually has the softer and smoother side. So I'll normally start with this side and then finish off with using this side. So basically this is how you use the jade roller. You would uh, massage it into your skin by moving it up and down in your skin. Or you can just pick a side like you want to move in this motion uh, from the bottom to the top like from the corner of your mouth to your cheekbones so you basically use this um all over your face and like i said whatever i do on my face i like to bring it down to my neck because it actually helps my neck to benefit from everything that is going on along my face so you can go a little bit deeper if you feel like your skin is feeling, you know, tired or if you generally are feeling tired or are sleep uh, deprived. This is going to help you um, just to try and, you know, awaken your skin. It does feel a little bit funny over the forehead because it's just a skull and there's not much fat going on there. But um, trust me, uh, you get used to the feeling. So basically this is how it would feel um, when you go uh, to do a facial, most likely. Um, like once you've done your facial, um, you feel like rejuvenated. So I actually love this uh, because it feels like I'm at a facial spa every other day. You can count as to how many times you do it. Some people like, like counting like one, two, three, moving to another section, one, two, three, one, two, three. So you can do that. I just love doing it um, as many times as possible until I feel like, okay, my skin is the, my skin has arrived. So obviously uh, this area of my eye, I'm not able to like really um, 
achieve like a good massage of for it so that's where i would go in with um the smaller um roller okay i think you can see that there's still um some um aloe vera jelly that is on my face and i'll be going in with it um, and i'll start going in with um, the smooth side of my jade roller just to let it sell, settle in and then i'm gonna move on to using uh, my gua sha stone and basically show you how it also benefits your skin So this first round where I'm actually like going on in with this, it's just to finish off the aloe vera jelly. Otherwise, I will be finishing this off and sealing it off with the light uh, weight facial oil. Okay, so now I'm going in with my uh, lightweight uh, facial oil. This is the one I've always been using um, by Avon. Um, I'm still loving it and I think it's really uh, doing the most for my skin. So you would apply um, your facial oil and just gently massage with your hand and then go in with uh, the jade roller. Remember, everything we do on the face, we bring it down to the neck. So this is a trick that my mother taught me. I think I was like 10 years old. That every time you actually um, have like a facial skincare routine, you have to bring it down to your neck and get into the habit of pulling your neck up instead of, instead of pulling it down because the skin around the neck is a lot uh, looser um, in comparison to what happens around your face. So you find that your skin benefits a lot from these facial products and these massages and then your neck is left out of the fun. Firstly, I'll be going in with the smaller um, roller. This one is more in a circular shape um, in comparison to the other one that I have. Um, and it's much, much heavier um, because it has to really go into those areas uh, where I'm not able to arrive with the bigger one. So I'm just gonna start off with this one and show you how I actually move it um, around my face. So if you're somebody who struggles with a lot of uh, like eye puffiness, um, this is a go-getter because um, you can actually keep um, your aloe vera jelly um, or your serum and your jade roller in the fridge overnight. And then in the morning, when you take it out and actually use it, you can actually feel a lot of the calming effects of the jade stone as well as um, the aloe vera jelly. And it will actually help a lot with improving, you know, your eye puffiness and a tea, what do you call them tea bags they're called tea bags even or eye bags basically so it'll help with a lot of your eye bags um if you use this in the morning and you use it while it's cold so on hot days i love to keep mine in the fridge and it really really does wonders for me as soon as i use it my skin literally responds because it feels like you're moving an ice cube over your skin which actually helps uh, improve the blood flow circulation around your skin and it helps your skin to like really be awake so after going in um, in those areas, um, then I can go in with the bigger one. So this is really helpful, like uh, in you know really getting um, the oil um, in all the parts of your face and really distributing the oil and any other serum that you're applying, you know, evenly along the skin. I've seen people actually using this to actually apply their foundation. So I haven't tried that yet, but I think I'm looking forward to actually trying it out or just doing one patch to actually see if this is really um, a thing or it's just, you know, people trying to trick you into doing stuff that doesn't work. As always. <laughs> 
so i think you're gonna see um, um i think you saw in the other one in the other video that i actually made that i have um, a gua sha stone also as part of um the set that i got for myself um, i'll be using the gua sha stone as well to actually try so the gua sha stone actually is shaped in such a way that it helps you to really um go into areas like your jawline and your cheekbones um as well as i think your crow's feet area to actually try and sculpt your face in a motion that you want it to look like there's people who actually have sculpted their faces literally using jade stone um the jade roller as well as the gua sha stone and i've seen that happening so i'm really curious as to uh is my face going to change um in terms of the structure um after i've used this like for a longer period of time so over here is the gua sha stone that actually comes with uh, the set um it's shaped in this way as you can see so i would normally use this area of it to actually get into those uh, jawline areas and you know the cheekbone areas when i'm really trying to sculpt and using this part of it to actually move along the rest of my face to try and move my face and open it up so that my blood flow and the motion of the face will actually move in that direction to try and you know keep it all zhuzhed up I really am looking forward to actually using this for a longer period of time to actually see if it's going to really help with the face lines. I have a lot of face lines around my mouth area because I am a love aholic and um, I think a little bit of um, this area has some face lines and over here. So I'm really looking forward to actually using this and seeing if um, there are any improvements in terms of the face lines along my face as, I've, as I use this um, product. So if you have like your facial, um, what do you call this thing? Like your sheet uh, face mask, you can actually use your jade um, roller to actually apply it. Like you just put it on um, and then you move uh, your jade uh, roller on top of it just so that it settles in. Um, so that it settles into your skin while you actually give your face um, a nice massage. It's like a win-win situation. Okay, so I've been doing this for like over a period of like 5 to 15 minutes, <laughs> 5 to 10 minutes. And I think my skin feels manipulated, like not in a bad way, but you know, it feels like this, it feels a lot stimulated and the feel on my skin is a little bit nice nicer than usual so i think after using this for a longer period of time i'm definitely going to be seeing a lot of results that are actually going to benefit my skin so i'm a little bit on the oily side i will try to actually massage the rest of it using my fingers so that it's not um too oily otherwise um that's basically how i use a jade roller i would like to um encourage um other people i would like to encourage you guys to actually get yourself a jade roller i will try to put a link in the description uh, box below of how you can get it or the one that i actually got on uh, take a lot um, i hope it's still available um and if not i will give you guys the next best alternative so that you can try it out and see uh, how it benefits you so that we can just introduce um nice things to our facial skincare routine if you like this kind of video please make sure to hit the like comment and subscribe button if you're new to this family please consider subscribing to this channel otherwise i am done here